umbilicus are two. I believe the two blues going this way. Yeah, there's funny. There's two away and one back because of the pressure thing. So once your umbilical cord, you know, is cut, and what happens to the um, this? All that stuff, it dies. It just becomes a scar. Yeah. It's amazing that once the blood flow stops, the vessels actually begin to shrink and then they harden. And they, no blood flow means I die. Awesome. Same thing with your belly button. Once you clamp it, eventually just falls off because the tissue is just tied around it. Sure. So we have, from baby's point of view, I'm going to send, it doesn't short roll, but I'm going to send blue blood from my iliacs mm -hmm. down here out to moms. Those are umbilical arteries going to go away okay. from my heart. To mom, they pick up oxygen so that they become red. They're going to go back to my body, hence a vein, out that's my belly button, vein. and that's an umbilical vein, which then plums into my um, vena cava. Okay. So that'd be my ductus venosus, okay. my vein duct. It goes up to my heart, plums around. There's a ductus arteriosus, which you can't really see, that's the ligamentum arteriosum mm -hmm. scar. And then remember your foramen ovale. It's that little hole to keep the tooth from going to your lungs. That's it? Yep. Okay.